Hi there, Chris here. Quick pick Thursday. So I thought I would take my racing Lockwood, and I've raced this a lot of times against Paul Springett, and I have used the racing Bentley, and this was made by Daz Evers and sent to me. And Paul Springett also has a racing Bentley that Daz made him. And so we have raced against this this uh, model of padlock, oh, two or three times, I think. Anyway, what I thought I would do for Quick Pick Thursday is go and use a butcher's block custom pick to see if it can pick into this and if it's see if it's actually race ready. So there's the padlock. It works beautifully. It's a cool old Australian block wood. And it's the cool one of the cooler ones that has the patent on the bottom. And this is the bidding on the key, not too tough. It's good for racing. So let's see how Butcher's Block does with it. Now I haven't been well, I haven't been racing this uh, <laughs> this Lockwood for quite a while, but we'll see. Well, I have to say, that is race ready. <laughs> I might have to go more rounds, more Lockwood racing rounds with this new <laughs> Butcher's Block race ready pick. Um, I mean, that's out of the box. We haven't even fine tuned it. We haven't, you know, messed with the fuels or the balance or, or fuel injection or anything. I mean, just out of the box. And I believe, no, it's not that one. We, we should try this racing one that has the magnetic feature. <laughs> anyway, check out Butcher's Blocks picks. They are just totally awesome. And like I say, they're race ready. So if you want to do some Lockwood racing, I would get on over to Butcher's Block and get you some race picks. All right, thanks for watching Quick Pick Thursday. We will see you next time.